The question is, why doesn't the master's college teach psychology? Uh, the answer is, by definition, psychology, the study of the soul, is uh, a secular, godless, unbiblical approach to analyzing humanity, designing solutions to their problems. But the truth is, man, in his fallen condition, cannot really make a completely clear and accurate assessment of the human condition. Certainly, he can't offer true solutions to what goes on in life. Unless you understand people the way the Bible lays them out as fallen, dead in sin, blind, cut off from the life of God, deceived, and desperately wicked, you can't get to the solution. But human psychology doesn't see man that way. Human psychology, because it's simply a reflection of the pride of man's fallen heart, overestimates man's capability, man's value, man's goodness, consequently never really gets to the problem. And oh, by the way, as far as psychiatry goes, uh, for many years since Freud kind of invented that, uh, all kinds of counseling therapy techniques were tried, and they just kept falling by the wayside and falling by the wayside until finally, a psychiatrist today basically give people pills. They medicate them, which doesn't solve anything, but dulls the feelings of anxiety. That's not a solution to anything. A right diagnosis of man leads to a right remedy, and both are revealed in Scripture. So we teach people a true understanding of man, his condition, and a true path of genuine solutions that, that change lives. They come from the Word of God.